do. Just about. We shouldn't hang around too long. Good to see a friendly face. Last light indeed. Savour it while you can. Jahira seems sure of you. I hope she's right. This barricade might keep the shadows out, but it won't help against what's already inside. There's more where that came from. Wish we had stone or steel. I wish we had a bloody army. Something to get rid of me too. So cold. me from the curse. The 
<sighs> Time to press ahead. Poor Jonas. Kid was as green as they come. He was joking this morning. Jonas, I mean. He was always joking. He said it was good for morale, but he just liked seeing people laugh. He was a good harbor. Good friend. I hope so. They're all I have to give. Thank you. You're a good person.
catch you. <clears throat> Take a stroll, have a drink. Enjoy them while you can. Close enough. Artifact or no, I don't like the likes of you crashing our party. Give it a rest, Alfred. We need all the God's damned help we can get. Rescue party. Not that you'll give a triple shat damn, but we were ambushed by them bloody cultists. Bastards torched the pigsty we were staying in and made off with the Grand Duke of Baldur's Gate himself. Sure did. For all the good that does us. She's inside. One of the ground floor chambers. Guess you need to be a God's damned counselor to get room and board around here. How's the barricade coming along? Uh, it ain't pretty, but it can take a bit. It'll need to. Won't hold out the darkness forever. I thought you'd be in the city by now. We were ambushed by cultists. Half of us were captured, the other half ran here. Off the anvil into the forge. We'll find them, hopefully. Before you run off into the belly of the beast, there's something I need to tell you. Well, two things, good news and bad news. The good news, obviously. I only need one more piece of infernal iron to craft an insulating chamber that can make it possible for Carlet to touch people. Exactly. Oh my God, it's really happening. It's been so long. We've got the iron, let's do this thing. Hang on. I think you'll want to hear the bad news too. Yeah, sure. But first, fix me. Please. Fine. Well, go on then. I don't enjoy saying this, Karlak. But there's no two ways about it. Your engine is going to blow and I can't fix it. I'm not sure anyone can. It's simply too hot to exist here in the material plane. Unless you return to Avernus. For good. This thing is going to blow. Sooner rather than later. But... But still, you, you can give me something that will let me touch again, right? Safely. Yes, but... That's all I need to know. Do it. Please. Right. This shouldn't take long. Same as last time. You'll need to install it yourself. This should do the trick. Did it work? Only one way to find out. <sighs> if 
Thank you. I can't believe it. Thank you, Dallon. Thank you so much. It's the least I could do. Before you go, there's something I need to tell you. That engine of yours, it's contained for the moment, but it's just too hot to exist here in the material plane indefinitely. I know you know that, but the thing is, there's a cure. I wasn't making any headway with the mechanics, none at all. The environment here is just too cold to sustain metals like the ones inside you. You have to return to Avernus. For good. Or this thing is going to burn you up from the inside out. And sooner than you think. The minute I set foot back in Avernus, Zarya will force me back into service. I'm not doing her bidding again. I'd rather die. I get that, but don't rule it out. The world just might be better with you in it. Even in Avernus. I won't stop trying to figure out a cure, but at this point, I think we all have to face the inevitable. You read my mind. Thanks, Damon. Really, you've given me more than I could ever repay. It's been my pleasure. Good luck, both of you. Look after yourself, all right? Give up now. This is the best day. The best day. I'm so happy for me too. Now I just need to find someone to cuddle up to tonight and I'll be the happiest woman on the Sword Coast. Not sure. Depends who's got me in mind. Withers was giving me the old eye the other night. Then again, maybe it was just an old eye. Listen, I'm never going back. If you said I could die right now or live a thousand years in the hells, I'd choose to go out now with my freedom intact. I don't expect anyone to understand that. But I've been dealt a hand most people don't have to contemplate playing. You heard Damon. There is no solution. It's hell or bust. I choose bust. But... I don't want to talk about this now. I've been given a huge gift. I can touch the people I love for the first time in a decade. And for the first time in a decade, there are people I care about all around me. Let me enjoy that, please. Thanks, soldier. I just want to celebrate this, at least for a little. It's you. What are the odds? So glad you're all right. Well, as all right as any of us. 
A makeshift harper's fire might not be where I hope to set up shop. But maybe I've got something you can use anyway. And if you find any interesting materials in need of working, I'm happy to help. I hesitated to mention this back in the Druid's Grove, for obvious reasons. But no one has earned my trust, if not you. When Elturel was dragged into Avernus, I was drafted into a Devil's Smithy. It should have been awful. But infernal metal is like a wild horse. Powerful, exuberant. It'll kill you if you lack technique. I can sense some. Smell it almost. Somewhere in the area. Underground, maybe. Out there in the shadows. If you find it, bring it to me. I'll make something incredible. Absolutely. Rare to get your hands on this stuff. Well done keeping it to hand. There you are. And be careful who you show that to. It might draw the wrong kind of attention. Need anything? It's perfect. Really. Just a moment. I'll be able to work this one quickly. show that to. It might draw the wrong kind of attention. Need anything? Well, well, well. I knew I smelled something. And I know just what to do with him. One moment. Need anything?
I'll be here if you need anything else. Don't burn yourself. Looking ahead. Wanna dance? Indolence breeds madness. Salutations.
these things have stayed interesting. My faith will guide me. Let's move. I'd love to, thanks. Glad to see you made it. I am. Indeed I am. On the double. One hoof quickly following the other. I remember you from the grove with the druids. I hoped I'd see you again. And now I have. and a clean stall. The simple life! Is that so much to ask?
stay idle. I think I've seen it all. At least it's dead now. I'm done. I can't wait to sleep. Gods above and devils below. That ox was a bloody shapeshifter. Thanks for handling it. <laughs> 